on Monday evening, Lipusi community in the Nanumba North municipality was thrown into a state of shock when petrol drums belonging to a local petrol dealer caught fire, leading to several injuries and destruction of properties. Residents who say they were taken unaware by the inferno narrate how nearby houses caught fire immediately after the exclusion. The inferno trapped persons who were in their houses either cooking dinner or relaxing. Residents say they struggled to rescue the trap. Two persons who were in a critical condition, including a nine-year-old girl, were referred to Tamale Teaching Hospital. One of the persons sent to Tamale Hospital is reported dead on Tuesday. City News visited the community to assess the extent of damage. Three houses were burnt and several properties, including food produce, were destroyed. Here is a house owner whose house and properties were destroyed in the fire, counting his losses to City News. Andrew, I see no. I am a safe. I am a Because I am a safe. 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 A course of side do be beside him. I say my busy are phoning. I jack will be a mamma do a mark or two hospital. And if I one one six, and there I ask a crammer back or craft for my friend. And to see a mejina he me won't give me pa me won't your course of see because a moi and film my ma me won't your mayor. He say my busy are phoning now be a diarrhea passo. A denning nashe may be biashe. The assembly man for the area. Also spoke to City News. Yesterday that I saw the fire in this particular house. So we all rushed in and saw that uh, there was some items burning there. And then I reported first to the VRE. They off the line and then we called Nad more to come and assist us. Before they got here, there wasn't access to get to the, this particular house. So the items have got burnt and the, it's about the casualties were sex who were rushed to the hospital. And this morning, one was reported dead. So as I'm standing, I don't know where to start the story and where to end it. But what I know is that we need assistance for the affected person. The nine-year-old girl whose legs got bent tells City News that she was helping her auntie in cooking when the incident happened. <laughs> Some of the victims are responding to treatment in the hospital. This is the house that was bent at Leposi in the Nanumba North Municipality. Residents here are counting their losses. As you can see behind me, um, granos and other things have bent beyond recognition. Three houses have been affected. And as I'm told, one person is dead. Reporting for City News, Mohammed Aminu M. Alabira from Leposi, Fatima.